What's going on folks? Today's review will be the 2015 to 2019 Cartoon Network series. And this one is... We Bear Bears. Another great modern Cartoon Network show along with Adventure Time, Regular Show, and other good shows from the modern Cartoon Network. Except for Teen Titans Go and Fanbarkets Roar. We Bear Bears was originally and currently airing on Cartoon Network, Boomerang, also in the Canada. Originally aired on Teletoon, originally streamed on Netflix, and currently streaming on Hippo Max, Amazon Prime Video, and Yulu and its beta on Disney+. Plus. The series follows three anthropomorphic adopted brother bears, Grizzly, Panda, and Ice Bear. The bears attempt to integrate with human society, such as by purchasing food, making human companions, or trying to become famous on the internet, although these attempts see the bears struggle to do so due to the civilized nature of humans and their own animal instincts. However, in the end, they figure out that they have each other for support. The bears often form a bear stack, which they use to get around the city, and has become perhaps the most recognizable image from the show. Occasionally, the bears share adventures with their friends, such as child prodigy Chloe Park, Bigfoot Charlie, the bears rival and internet sensation Koala Nom Nom, Park Ranger Tibbs, and produce saleswoman Lucy. Some flashback episodes chronicle the adventures of the bears as cops trying to find a home. The writing for this show is pretty simple, as it is mainly a laid-back comedy with some wackiness, it does also have a lot of heart to it, on top of having some sullen humor. There are even a few episodes that chronicle the bears, when they were cubs. There are also some pretty well handled morals in this. The show does have plenty of nicely done episodes like Burrito, Primal, Shush Ninjas, Occupied Bears, Emergency, Toad Life, Chloe and Ice Bear, Yard Sale, The Island, Captain Krabu, Yuri and the Bear, Creature Mysteries, Christmas Parties, Professor Lampwick, Ralph, Poppy Rangers, Kyle, The Icy Knights Duology, Hurricane Hell, Bear Squad, The Limo, Charlie's Halloween Thing 1 and 2, Imaginary Friend, and The Mall. The show does have a pretty solid sense of humor, as, while the jokes don't always get a laugh, a good chunk of them do get a solid laugh like the witty banter and dialogue between the characters, the wacky and insane situations they get themselves in, the gags and slapstick, and Ice Bear's deadpan reactions and quips. The show has a good amount of heart to it, as seen with the overall laid-back tone of the show, and with moments like the bears' flashbacks to their childhood, the life lessons that are taught throughout the series, and some of the more tender moments like the relationships between the characters. The animation is pretty decent and does have a nice look to it. The characters all have pretty solid designs and fluid movements, the backgrounds are pretty well done, and there are some nice effects. The characters all manage to be pretty likable, while also being very simple, and they do have some nice chemistry. The bears, grizzly, panda, and ice bear, are all very solid and likable protagonists, as they do have some nice chemistry, and work great off each other thanks to their differing traits and personalities like grizzly being more carefree, panda being more timid, and ice bear being more stoic. The rest of the characters are also all pretty solid and likable, and do serve as solid support, whether as friends or as antagonists like the incredibly smart young girl Chloe, the vain and self-centered Koala Nom Nom, the friendly Bigfoot Charlie, the very confident and determined Ranger Tibbs, the sweet and caring Lucy, the Bears human doppelgangers the brothers, the strong Yana, the tech savvy Barry, the underground pigeon cartel, the mischievous Yeti Ralph, and more. The voice acting is pretty good and the cast members do deliver solid performances like Eric Adelstein as Grizzly, Bobby Moynihan as Panda, Dimitri Martin as Ice Bear, Charlie Nui as Chloe, Patton Oswald as Nom Nom, Jason Lee as Charlie, Cameron Esposicio as Ranger Tibbs, Ellie Kemper as Lucy, and many more. The music is pretty sweet and does have a nice and soothing tone to it, and it does really fit with the overall laid-back tone of the show. Not only that, speaking about its movie. This show has its direct-to-video movie released on June 30, 2020 on digital and DVD from Warner Brothers Home Entertainment. And September 7, 2020 on Cartoon Network. We Bear Bears, the movie in 2020. Which is a great movie. After its show unfortunately ended and got cancelled in 2019, this show came back on New Year's Day in 2022 with its spin-off. We Baby Bears in 2022. 
which that show is also great. Overall, the best way to describe this show is cute and fun. This is a pretty enjoyable show that is worth recommending. So there is nothing to say but to give this show a 10.5 out of 10. We should probably leave before someone calls the popo.